Amigos, ahora nos encontramos con la nueva sangre de New Blood o The Young Blood of the MLS, uh, Robin Fraser, que fue presentado hoy, el día de hoy, como nuevo director técnico de Chivas USA, new head coach of uh, Chivas USA. How do you feel about this? I'm excited. I'm really excited. I think this is a, a great fan base, a great community. Um, I, I'm excited to give the team or the fans something to be proud of. I'm excited to help the team give the fans something to be proud of. Dice que estaba muy emocionado, obviamente, a los, eh, a los grandes eh, aficionados que tiene Chivas USA, por supuesto, a él le dedica todo esto y va a trabajar muy fuerte para realmente regresar Chivas USA a lo que ha venido siendo en esta liga de la MLS. Uh, was it difficult to, take, to make the decision uh, to become head coach uh, for Chivas USA? ¿Fue difícil uh, convertirte, tomar la decisión? To be fair, initially it was a little bit difficult because uh, we, we had built a good team in Utah and uh, my family was very comfortable there and we felt like that team was going to achieve some really good things and I think they still are. But the allure of being a head coach certainly was part of it. And then uh, I was very impressed when I met with the ownership group and I liked the direction that they're going and that they want to go to. And it just seemed like a great challenge to come in and take a team that had not done well last year and uh, help those guys because there are a lot of good players. Help those guys turn it around and and become, as I said, a team that the fans here can be proud of and a successful team. Estaba muy contento en Utah con Ralph Salt Lake, donde él era eh, asistente del del, uh, del cuerpo técnico. Pero dice que obviamente convertirse en, en director técnico de un equipo ya de la MLS era su sueño y por supuesto eso fue una de las razones por las cuales se vino aquí a Chivas USA, además de proveerles a los aficionados a un gran equipo. Uh, what is your commitment, what is your goals uh, for, for this team and obviously uh, on, on a personal level? Right, uh, I get asked that question about goals. My goals are pretty simple. To be honest, the goal is improvement and that goal exists every day. It's improvement. We've got to be better tomorrow than we were today and then the next day than we are tomorrow. And I think with that sort of attitude and commitment uh, and the commitment to improve every day, I think results will come. Obviamente dice que sus metas y sus compromisos es eh, simplemente mejorar el equipo, mejorar el equipo porque lo que sucedió la temporada pasada la verdad no fue nada bueno para el equipo y lo que, quiere, lo que anda buscando es mejorarlo para esa temporada con, a través del trabajo. Eh, well, send, send a message to, to the people, uh, to all the people who are going to be watching, uh, uh, obviamente, obviamente, and obviously this, this team uh, coming uh, this on, his, on its seventh uh, uh, season. Uh, interesting, uh, you know, seven is a, it's a, it's a nice number. Uh, may, maybe maybe you'll make it happen. Lucky seven, yeah. I mean, the message to the fan base would be, come out and support this team. They're going to be a team that you're going to be proud of because they're a good number of players, they're a good group of guys, and we're going to get them into a position where they're playing the type of soccer that you want to see. So come out and see them, and they're going to be exciting. Robin. Congratulations. Thank you. And you, you had a lot of work to do. I do. <laughs> I do. That's okay. And so does the team. And together, we're going to do it. Thank you. All Thank right. you very much. I Thank appreciate you. it. Pues ahí está, amigo, las palabras de Robin Fresher, nuevo director técnico de Chivas USA. Dice que promete que la verdad va a trabajar muy fuerte y que obviamente devolverle a Chivas USA lo que le pertenece aquí en esta liga, que es estar en los primeros lugares. Yo soy Leo Muciño, Pulso Deportivo Plus. Estamos con ustedes lunes y viernes a las 11 de la noche, además de los sábados a las 7 de la noche. Gracias.